Hello there folks, Dragster here, Minor League Sansar personality, and I'm in VR today because I want to show you how to explore Sansar. You can of course do this in desktop as well. We're here at the Nexus, and if I walk down, this is actually where I am resing, where I'm appearing is the stairs. Uh, we have this guy over here. Hey Sam, how are you? I'm recording a tutorial. Um, you're welcome to follow me if you like. Recording this at a god-awful time, that's why it's empty. Uh, here at the Nexus, you have the map key, Nexus Entry, Agent Primus, Prime Portal, Monster Cat Portal. There's a whole bunch of things. You can go to these different places. Um, but what I want to show you first is how you actually access the, the plethora of worlds that have been built by users from all over the world. Now, this is the main area here at the Nexus. By going in here... If you click here, you actually activate the Prime Portal. Now, you can see the events. You can see popular. Here at the events are the upcoming events. You can see popular places. You can see featured places. You can see community favorites if you scroll down. And so these are all ordered for you, curated, if you will. You have new places, places that have just been created. You have recently updated or upgraded places. Ooh, the Halloween hay maze. I haven't been there. Now, you can search worlds right here. So, I'm still in VR, so I'm going to punch in, for example, game. And return. And I have 54 results. Now, this is looking at everything that's available in Sansar. There are several thousands of experiences that are listed. Uh, thousands of unlisted, of course. Here's the Moya Museum. I love it. But this is very important to understand. Th these places here, these are all the places. Because when you uh, don't go to this prime portal here, to the prime portal right here, and click on here, you will, let's go outside, you will see if you click the in your inventory if you click the world icon all you see is visited favorites friends and my world so if you click on your world icon here in your main menu on your left wrist in VR you can see you have visited you have favorites, you have friends, you have my worlds. Now, these are the worlds that you are associated with in this context, in the visited context, in the favorites context, meaning you actually favorited them. For example, harvest here, you can favorite by hitting the, the, the heart. And you have friends. These are your friends worlds that are listed here. You know, well, you can reorder them. They're here now and recently created. You can also put them from A to Z. And you have My Worlds. My Worlds are the ones that you created that are public. These are My Worlds right here. Again, very important. This is not... This does not contain every world that is out there in the entire Sansa universe. If you click the, the World button you will only see what you have visited, what you have favorited, what your friends have created, and the worlds that you created yourself. Now, if I go to the Prime Portal again, let's pick a world. Let's look for a world that I know I have never been to. For example, a recently created here by Robin, my friend Robin. Now, if I click around the visit, I'm not cl clicking the visit button. I'm clicking either the name or I click around the visit button. Now here, I can... Now here, I can love this world, which puts it into my favorite but I have to visit it first. Now, let's go and visit it. It shoots me to this world right away. I could have also created a portal if I'm with friends, but let's just go here. And now, 
you will see here I am and Robin is actually here she doesn't hear me because I'm speaking into a different microphone I'm the stalker but now look at this I'm looking at visited and I have Robin's world in visited now I can give it a love boom I'll close it now I have it in visited not only in visit but I also have it in favorites and I'm going to recently create it there it is right there Robin's is not only in my favorites it's in my visited and it should also be in actually my friends because she's my friends of course it's not in my worlds because I didn't create it let's go back to the Nexus who Robin didn't see me she was mesmerized by the wall and that's it and this is how you discover this is how you put worlds that you like into your favorites list into your visited list and one thing that remains to to show you if I click on the prime portal and I find something that I like and I would be here with friends for example let's look at the monster cat call of the wild this is where they have their podcast live actually did I visit this before I should have oh no yeah actually that's why I can give it some loving right next to the loving button is the create a portal button which creates a portal this portal will stay up for two minutes and if I were here with my friends again who are we kidding I don't have any friends but I could make some then I could we could all go through this portal by clicking the portal and by visiting it again also important you click the portal you don't walk straight through it you have to click it but that's that that's how you explore things. Ooh. I look good through the through the portal. Thank you guys. Have fun in Sansa. Dragster out. Oh, addendum before we go. I should show you how this works in desktop. So here I'm at the prime portal, right? And same thing. I'm clicking the prime portal. At the prime portal, I see events, I see popular, I see featured. I see community favorites, new and so on and so forth. Just the same thing. And again, if I were to click, for example, Star World, which is Scorpion's new world, if I wanted to give him some love and without visiting it, that doesn't work. Now I'm here at Star World. Magnificent. I don't know what it is, but it's certainly cool. If I then go to my codex, which is in my list here. Again, we have visited, we have favorites, we have friends, we have worlds. This is the last one that I visited, right? The one before Robin's world in VR. Now, I can actually love it, which shoots it over to my favorites list. And I can also create portals for other people. So here in my favorites list, if I were to go to recently created, that brings up Robins, that brings up Star Wars. Robin meantime changed her uh, thumbnail here, interestingly enough. And uh, Star World should also show up in my friends list because Scorpion is my friend and it should not show up in my walls. But this is important to understand. Now I can create a portal. Um, makes no sense that I create a portal in the world that I have that I'm that I'm in currently but you have to visit a world first before you can actually invite other people so you are the explorer you're tasked to go there you're tasked to check it out and then you will see it in your visited list which will then enable you to go uh, with your friends or recommend it to your friends. Actually, I could do this right now. I'm going back to the Nexus, and here we have Toto. Um, hello, Toto. We're not in Kansas anymore. I should probably put my microphone on. Hello, Toto. 
I would like to show you a world. I will now create a portal for you, Toto. I don't know if you can hear me, but I'm just, I just keep talking. I, I create this portal for you, Toto. Oh, well, Toto is gone, but Demetra is here. And this portal is now my portal. And folks um, would be able to follow me through there. And that's it. Have fun exploring. Dragster out. Demetra. I'm going to befriend you so we can go through the portal. <laughs>